Just made myself a coffee using my Skinny Food Co. French Vanilla Syrup. Honestly, this stuff is incredible. I haven't really got that much left. Like, it's down to here. This stuff is honestly incredible. If you're looking for a syrup to put in your coffee, then I highly recommend this company. Hey, Google. Connect to Spotify. Sure. Playing Spotify. I got my driver's license last week. Hey Google, stop. Hey everyone, so welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm just getting ready for the day. I've just done my makeup and I don't usually make this much effort but I've just spent like a good half an hour doing my makeup for no reason. Literally, the only people I'm gonna see today is you guys, but anyway. Um, I'm just gonna do my hair because it's gone a bit funny from being asleep. So, I hope you're all doing well. Um, in today's video, I'm literally just gonna vlog. Like, that's as interesting as my videos can get at the moment. Obviously, the UK is still in lockdown. We're not gonna talk about it because it's boring and we're all fed up of it. Um, so I'm gonna try and be your distraction for however long this video is. Today, I've got a few things planned. So I thought, you know what, I'll just do a vlog. I asked you guys the other day on Instagram um, for like some suggestions of what you wanted to see on my channel and literally everyone said just like daily vlogs so I'm going to try and do a few more of those um so yeah what am I doing today I'm gonna finish getting ready I've had my morning coffee I'm then going to go and have some breakfast because I haven't had breakfast yet I'm either gonna have cereal or I've got a new favorite breakfast which I love I've been making like apple and cinnamon uh porridge and it's honestly really good like i'm not a breakfast lover i don't really enjoy breakfast but now i'm not doing anything and i'm not working i can have it a bit later which suits me perfectly um i don't know what is going on with these little bits in my hair like anyone else have little baby hairs all around their face it's so annoying yeah so i'm gonna have my new favorite breakfast probably and then i'm gonna go for a walk i've been listening to some music this morning and I don't know what it is, and I feel like, you know, it's it's quite a normal thing to really enjoy music, but if I listen to music in the morning so I'm getting ready, I do feel like I have a better day, and it sounds so silly, but I just, it just makes me so happy. Like, if I sit here and get ready in silence, I just feel a bit rubbish, but as soon as I put some music on, it just makes me feel ten times better, so... I've been listening to some songs. I've also started doing a thing on my Instagram where I post like a song of the day every day because I saw Mark Ferris doing it on his Instagram and I thought, do you know what? That's a really good idea. This is a good time to be discovering some new music and some new bands and stuff. So um, I've started doing that on my Instagram. So if you want to follow me, then head over to Instagram and give me a follow. Um, I'll put my username on the screen but yeah so i'm gonna go for a nice walk put my headphones in and just zone out um i don't know why i bothered to do my makeup actually because it is raining and it's really horrible outside so that's gonna get ruined anyway um but yeah so i'm gonna go and do that i'm gonna have a nice walk i then need to go and do my weekly food shop um i have been going a lot less to the supermarket now just to kind of reduce my risk and to be a little bit safer i'm used to going to the shop every like other day i would just sort of go and pick up bits for like the next two days but i've been having to sort of plan my meals a little bit more and um yeah try not to go as much so i am gonna be going today because i've basically got no food left i am still doing veganuary if any of you were wondering not that you were um yeah i'm still going strong on that really enjoying it actually um i've discovered some new favorite dishes and um yeah it's just been a lot easier than i expected it to be so that's my plan for this morning this top is really old so please don't ask me where it's from it well it was from top shop but literally about six years ago. Like, I'm not even joking. It's got a hole in the arm where my gerbil chewed a hole in it, and I haven't had gerbils for years, so that's how old it is. Um, anyway, let's get changed, and let's go and have some breakfast. 
Okay, so I've just started on my breakfast. I've basically chopped up an apple, added some cinnamon, agave nectar, this stuff, really delicious, uh, cinnamon and a little bit of hot water. And then I'm basically just gonna like stew the apples. It takes about 10 minutes. And when it's coming to the end of them stewing, you add in some porridge oats and then some milk. And it basically makes like a delicious apple porridge. So obviously you could add whatever else you want. Sometimes I add raisins or dried cranberries. Breakfast is served. I don't think you can ever make porridge look nice, but I promise it does taste delicious. Got my 2021 vision board as my screensaver because I feel like, you know, it's necessary. Okay, so I've had breakfast, I've brushed my teeth and taken my hair out. I put it in a plait to make it go a bit wavy. Didn't really do a lot. Um, anyway, I'm just looking outside and the weather is so gross and I know I need to go for a walk and I know it will make me feel good, but honestly, like, it's just disgusting outside. Okay, I'm ready to go to the shop. I'm gonna go for a little walk and then I'm going to go to Sainsbury's and then when I get back, I will show you what I've picked up. I've put my hair up because I know it's gonna go really frizzy um, because it's raining outside. I'm not wearing a coat because I'm honestly boiling hot. Um, got my bag ready. I'm just waiting for my AirPods to charge a little bit because I stupidly left them out the case. I always do that and it really annoys me. Okay, I am back from the shop, but I'm absolutely boiling <sighs> okay so i got a pretty decent shop in sainsbury's i ended up picking up way more than i was planning on um but i saw quite a few things on offer and i like to pick them up when they're on offer and i just saw some like random bits that i fancied so i kept my receipt in case anyone was interested i spent 21 pound 76 p and i got a lot of stuff like this is gonna last me for probably over a week i might just have to go and get like some more fruit or veg or something like that but this will last me a really long time and i got some like cupboard staples as well first thing i got was this unsweetened soya drink which is like sainsbury's own because basically i love my oatly barista oat milk um but you can't get it in a lot of shops and i am going through it so quickly now i'm making like vegan sauces and i make like a hot chocolate most evenings and stuff so i picked up this one just to have because it was like 80p i got some corn vegan chicken slices for lunches to go alongside those i also got some rolls also just a little disclaimer i'm pretty sure all of this stuff is vegan if it's not then i'm sorry i will double check before i eat everything because obviously like checking in the supermarket it takes quite a while so i'm pretty sure everything is vegan um i picked up all of these which are my favorite trek protein flapjacks salted caramel these are honestly delicious i then got some bourneville buttons because i i discovered last night that they are vegan which i didn't know i'm pretty sure they are anyway so i got those i've got some red onions i've got potato to have mashed potato apples because you guys know my new favorite breakfast um i got these i'm pretty sure these are vegan as well Bourneville, no not Bourneville, Bourbon. I then picked up my favourite coffee because it was on offer and I'm running out, the Nescafe Azira Americano. And then I got this, which I'm really excited to try. This is the Twinings Super Blend Sleepy Tea, which sounds really nice. So I'm gonna give that a go tonight. This one's quite healthy. So I've got some oranges. I've got a random sweet potato, so I'll make something with that. I've got some lettuce to have salads or in the rolls or in the burger. Um, I then got some cheese. This is the Violife Epic Mature cheese on offer at the moment, which was good. I got a broccoli. This is the organic one, which I didn't really necessarily want, but it was the only one they had. I got some Italian passata, because it's just handy to have it in the cupboard. And then last but certainly not least, I got some Biscoff because I've used all mine. Also, a little bit random, um, but I just got a delivery. I ordered a book on Amazon. I am reading a book at the moment. Um, I'm reading Women Don't Know You Pretty, and I am really enjoying it, but I want more of like a story book because they're the ones that actually like grip me and I end up reading quickly. So this is about a girl with OCD, I believe, and I've heard people talking about it. I heard Rihanna and Ashley um, going on about this book a while ago, and she said it was really good. So I have got this to start reading. Hey everyone, it's lunchtime. Um, I'm gonna have some leftover soup that I've got. Um, just gonna sanitize my hands. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have some leftover tomato soup. I'll show you what it is. So for the past few days, I've been having this for lunch and I've got a little bit left. So it's the Tesco tomato and basil soup. I, excuse me. I actually hate soup, fun fact for you, but I'm trying to like teach myself to like it because I know it's good for you if you have like fresh soup. 
So, yeah, I'm trying to teach myself to like it. Um, and I'm starting with a simple one. Let me know down below in the comments what your favourite soup is. Um, because I want to kind of broaden my horizons. And I want to like soup. So I'm trying to train myself to enjoy it. I would usually heat it up on the stove. But I simply can't be bothered. So, bowl of soup going in the microwave. And then I'm going to have a roll with it. So that is my lunch. I used some of the Flora vegan butter um, on my roll. Good afternoon. Um, I've just made myself a coffee. I've just been doing some boring stuff like putting my washing away and I took my bins down to my bin storage place. Um, I'm actually gonna paint my nail. Oh shit, I've just spilled my coffee. I'm going to sit and do my nails, so I'm just going to file them, and then I'm using the Barry M Jelly High Shine in the shade Lavender. Um, it's just a little lavender colour, basically, a little lilac moment. Um, I'm going to sit and watch Amy Banks on YouTube, watching her What I Got For Christmas video. They're looking a little bit gross right now, so we're going to change that, and we're going to make them look nicer. Something funny just happened <laughs> and I thought I'd share it with you. Um, I just remembered that I'm going to have sausage and mash for my dinner tonight. So I was like, right, I need to get some sausages out of the freezer because I had these ones in the freezer. Um, they're all really stuck together. So I tried hitting it with a wooden spoon and I broke it. <laughs> I thought it would work. I only want two out of the four. I don't want all four and they're really stuck together. I don't know how to separate them. So I've come to the conclusion. I'm just gonna have to defrost all four, which is annoying, but oh well. I'm just going to put them in the microwave. Like not actually, not actually turn the microwave on, but like let them defrost in there. Right, back to um, YouTube stuff. I have finished doing my work on my laptop and I've just got onto my bed and I'm gonna chill out and read some of my book. I've made a start on my dinner. I've got everything ready to cook. So I've got some leftover baby corn, literally from the other day, it's quite old. Um, I've got that and some broccoli ready to boil. I've then got my potatoes ready to boil and turn into mash. And then I've got my sausages. So as you guys saw, I had to defrost all four of them. So I'm gonna cook all four and then I'll have two leftover and I'll have them for my lunch tomorrow, like cold um, in a sandwich or something. So I'm just waiting for the oven to heat up so that I can actually cook my food. Um, but I just thought I'd show you, I had this gravy in my cupboard from normal times um, and I kind of assumed that it wouldn't be vegan. So I bought this one from Tesco, which is their like free from gravy or whatever. And then actually after buying that, I realized that this one is vegan and I've only got a little bit left of this one. So I'm gonna use this up. Um, and then just hope that that one is nice when I get around to using it. But yeah, I'm gonna use this gravy. My dinner is ready. I've also got some leftovers. So I had leftover mash, which I'm just gonna keep in this container and I'll probably like heat it up or something tomorrow. And I've also got some leftover sausages. I've just made my gravy, which I'm gonna pour all over this. Um, and I'm gonna sit and watch some Gilmore Girls. Luckily, I don't think you can see it in the camera, but I actually spilt my dinner all down me, so that's fun. Um, I've decided to make myself a milkshake. I'm gonna use the biscuits that I picked up today, along with some soya milk and some of the best vegan ice cream ever. This is the Swedish glacé or whatever ice cream. I'm gonna throw it all into my Nutribullet. Okay, I've got my milkshake. I'm really excited to try this. I hope it's nice. I think I put like three or four biscuits in. Um, I also added some vanilla syrup, like my skinny food company syrup, soya milk and ice cream. So let's give it a go. It's like got the consistency of a McDonald's milkshake. Oh my God, that is insane. That's so good. It literally tastes like chocolate milkshake. That is so good. It literally tastes like a shake away. 
So I've just come upstairs. Um, I finished my milkshake. Honestly, it was incredible. Like you would not know that it was a vegan milkshake and it didn't have dairy in it. Um, anyway, I'm going to have a bath. Now, usually I would take my makeup off before I get in the bath. Um, but this evening I'm actually going to keep it on because it's still pretty early. I think it's only like seven o'clock. Um, and I'm actually going to be facetiming someone later and I don't want to take all my makeup off um, because I just feel like it's a bit early so I'm just going to put my hair up and then I will show you guys what I'm going to be using in the bath it's not going to be anything too spectacular wow that really looks nice doesn't it I'm putting in some of the lavender bath bubble bath stuff from L'Occitane or L'Occitane, never know how to say it um, and then I think I've also got I'm also going to put a little bit of this uh, bath crumble in, it smells like black currants it's really really nice, that's from Lush so I'm going to do like a mixture of those two things Okay, my bath is ready. This is my little setup. Um, sometimes I would have like a gin or a glass of wine, but today I've just got water because that milkshake really filled me up. Um, anyway, so I've got a gorgeous pink bubble bath. I've got some candles. I've got um, Grac on in the background, Grace Booth, if any of you watch her. And then I've got another candle just over here to kind of set the mood a little bit. So yeah, really looking forward to just having a nice chill out in the bath. I've got my salt lamp on. Um... So it's very pink, makes my hair look like I've dyed it pink. Um, anyway, I've just got out of the bath. I had a really, really nice relax. And I just got to catch up on some YouTube videos, basically. Um, I'm now in my pyjamas. I've got my teddy with me. <laughs> I've got into bed, basically. Well, onto bed. Um, and I'm going to continue. I've got hair on me. I'm going to chill in bed all evening now and just watch YouTube videos. And I'll probably have... A cup of tea and a bit maybe a snack um but i'm quite full from that milkshake so yeah i hope you enjoyed this little vlog please let me know down below in the comments if you did leave me any video suggestions or anything down below in the comments but yeah thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed the video and i will see you very very oh my neck just clicked together and i will see you very very soon for another one goodbye